Let's actually talk about the integration in this movie. Okay. Everyone in this movie has either a British, Scottish, or Australian accent. Except for Freddie Prince Jr. Except for Freddie Prince Jr., who's constantly repressed. They should have just given him a blatant Mexican accent. <laughs> they should have just made him like, come on, man, let's put some rims on the rapier. <laughs> and then you got the, the black people. Who are always taking orders from everybody else. They're the only ones who listen to the orders, so they obviously are practically slaves. And yeah, Mr. Ubuntu. Yeah, Ubuntu, what, what did you say about him? He can only count down numbers. No, that was the other guy. That was the Scottish guy. All he did no. was repeat figures and units of time and look sweaty. Let's talk about whether we don't discriminate by color here. Black chick hits the ground. What do they do? I didn't think she was going to die. I thought Matthew Lillard had a big dead sign hanging around him because he was the best bud propping up the hero guy kind of thing, you know? I thought he was meat paste. But when they disobey a direct order and decide to kill themselves some Kilrathi at the tail end of one of the battles, she catches a Kilrathi ship in a thruster or something like that. Basically to the face. First, her ejector seat doesn't work. Because she's got one of the ones made for black people. And then, instead of trying to tow her in with tractor beams... <laughs> well, we haven't even established that they have tractor beams. They have. They, all she has to do, as I said... Throw a rope. <laughs> yeah, a rope. T- turn off your engine, get a couple aerosol cans, and just spray them behind you, because you are in the weightlessness of space, and just float down. Very slowly. Very slow. You're in no rush. Yeah, there's no battle going on anymore. No, you're done. Yeah. You killed all the Karathi against orders. So, you don't deactivate the engines of your ship but i mean you could have been towed maybe you could have jury rigged some some way of getting back in instead you got to try and fly in and land in hot which you know she can do because she did it earlier in the film and she mm-hmm. one-upped matthew little's character with her sweet 540 <laughs> so doesn't work so well this time when her ship's all messed up and, and disabled and malfunctioning she's on the other side of the force field airlock system that they've got going on there and matthew lillard's like give me a helmet give me a spacesuit give me the jaws of life we'll go save her her ship is right there it's not on fire because i guess that's the one thing they got right there might be sound in space but there's no flaming explosions or anything there like that. a little bit of on, on the side of the vacuum? Yeah. Oh, God, I didn't even see that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's some fire on that side. Well, he's trying to save her. She could still be alive in that wrecked but not completely destroyed chunk of spaceship that's sitting out there on the deck. And what did they decide to do? They're in a bit of a time crunch... Got some meetings to go to. Got to save the world. Get that garbage off my flight deck. Quote. Quote. And they scrape the black chick off the flight deck and into deep space with a f***ing space bulldozer. (laughs) All it is is a giant. It's on wheels even. It doesn't even have thrusters. It's just a bulldozer. Someone's got to be operating that stupid thing. You think you could knock on the cockpit and say, hey, you alive in there? It's all right. It's probably got the standard open air canopy that all other bulldozer does it doesn't look like there's any other modification except for six wheels instead of four (laughs) and they just scrape her off and knock her off the platform space bulldozer and it's at the end of the movie we realize two things if you're white or i guess freddie prince jr is half a jew then they use their tractor beam to rescue your disabled ship you have tractor beam technology all of a sudden where was that when the cute black girl with the british accent was sorry It's Operation Kill Darky right now. (laughs) Oh, my God. 